and in this question you must show all sets of your work the curve c has equation y equals to f of x and x is greater than zero given that the point p uh, 2 comma 8 square root 2 lies on c and f prime x equals to 4 square root of x cube plus k over x square where k is the constant and second derivative equals to zero at p find the exact value of k by using this information we have to find the value of k first of all you have to differentiate this function again first derivative is given so you need to find the second derivative so what is the first derivative f of x f prime x equals to uh, better you write uh, this way uh, because x cube could be written as uh, uh, 3 over 2 because square, square root is 1 over 2 plus k and x over negative 2 differentiate this derivative again so the second derivative will be uh, as per rule uh, the power rule this power will multiply uh, with the x value okay for keep outside it is the easiest way 3 over 2 will multiply with x and we reduce the power of x by 1 3 over 2 minus 1 uh, will be 1 over 2 3 over 2 minus 1 is 1 over 2 so you can write here 1 over 2 plus k and it will be negative 2 and we reduce the power by 1 x will be negative 3 simplify it will be 2 and this will be 6 x power 1 over 2 and negative 2 k x power negative 3 we know that at p uh, what is p p is uh, 2 8 uh, square root of 2 at p second derivative is equals to 0 we know that the first coordinate is x here okay and second derivative is 0 by using this these two things here this is the second derivative plug in these two values in the above equation this one is 0 and x value is 2 so it will be 6 to power 1 over 2 and negative 2 k power uh, k into x x is 2 2 power negative 3 so because this value is negative if you take this value to the other side of equation it becomes positive and you can write as 2 power negative 3 means 1 over 8 so you can write as 2 over 8 k 2 negative 3 means 1 over 2 power 3 and it is equals to 1 over 8 and uh, here you can write 6 square root 2 because 2 power 1 over 2 means square root of 2 and you cancel out these two values 4 and 4 is uh, dividing here it will multiply the other side and k will be equals to 24 square root of 2 so this is the answer for the first part the next part find f of x giving your answer in simplest form we have a uh, first derivative is given in the question uh, this thing and we just got the value of k that is uh, square 24 uh, square root 2 by using this information we can get the function how to get the function uh, we will integrate the derivative whenever the de derivative is given and you need to find the function you have to integrate it f of x could be written as derivative of that function this is the formula uh, because the uh, integral and uh, def uh, derivative could be cancelled with each other so replace the value of the first derivative first derivative is given there so better you write in power form 4x power 3 by 2 and uh, plus value of k is 24 square root 2 and uh, keep x square as a numerator numerator so it will be negative 2 dx now you can easily integrate this function according to the power rule uh, formula of integration is very basic formula we are using in p1 that is uh, this one power rule we increase the power by one and divide by the same power so you have to use this formula here we increase the power by one so function is equals to 4 x power 3 by 2 plus 1 uh, gives you 5 over 2 divide by 5 by 2 plus 24 square root 2 and we increase the power by 1 negative 2 plus 1 is minus 1 and divide by negative 1 plus c so simplify the third denominator always multiply up so this 2 will multiply 4 it will be 8 over 5 x power 5 over 2 and negative uh, applies there so it will be negative 24 square root 2 and x power minus 1 plus c and function is equal to this one the point p that is 2 and 8 square root 2 lies on the curve lies on this function on the curve c so this value is x 
this value is y or in other words f of x so f of x is 8 square root 2 replace these two values in the above equation to get the value of c so it will be 8 square root 2 equals to 8 over 5 and value of x is 2 and 2 power 5 over 2 minus 24 square root 2 and here value of x is 2 2 power minus 1 and plus c this 2 power minus 1 could be written in the denominator you know that you can write as 2 only and this 2 will be cancelled out so it will be 12 here 8 square root 2 if you use calculator for this okay simplify with the calculator because it is plus here you are moving this one to the other side of equation so it becomes negative so it will be th negative 32 over 5 square root 2 so this is negative 12 square root 2 um moves to the other side becomes positive 12 square root 2 equals to c now the final thing because square root 2 is everywhere there no need to write them uh, just on the calculator you can write 12 negative 32 over 5 and 8 finally you get the answer for left hand side will be 68 over 5 square root 2 so this is the answer for c final answer for f of x will be 8 over 5 x power 5 over 2 minus 24 square root 2 and uh, you can keep x power minus 1 in, as a denominator better you write this way and plus the value of c 68 over 5 square root 2 this is the final answer for this part and question number 8 is uh, over uh, uh, sorry this was question number 10 and uh, alhamdulillah exam is done p1 if you have any question any doubt please write in the uh, comment box thank you so much